Hello, welcome to our channel for R programming. In this video, we will show how to conduct Shapiro Wilk test for normality in R. So we know many of the statistical modeling are parametric tests based on the normal distribution. So for example, the rationale behind hypothesis testing relies on having something that is normally distributed. And many statistical modeling, for example, linear regression, we assume the data are at least approximately normal distribution. So it's very important that you have to check the normal distribution assumption before deciding which statistical test or modeling is appropriate. So one way to test the normal distribution is Shapiro-Wilk test, or say Shapiro test. So this is a normality test in frequentist statistics, and the null hypothesis of Shapiro test is that the population is distributed normally. So after the test, if the value of p is equal to or less than 0 0.05, then the hypothesis of normality will be rejected by the Shapiro test. So the function in R is Shapiro.test of a vector So next we will show how to use this function in R. So first we load the library for DPLYR because we want to use a dataset called tools growth from this package. So next we create a data frame called my data. It's the value is two screws. So we show this data set. The 60 observations with three variables, the length, soup, and the dose. So next we can use shapiro.test to test the normality of a variable length from this data frame. So you can see the result is p value is 0 0.1. So because the p value is greater than 0 0.05, so we say the distribution of the given data for the length is not significantly different from normal distribution. So we have no sufficient evidence to reject the neural hypothesis. So the, which is the neural hypothesis? In the Shapiro, we can test the neural hypothesis. Yes, we assume the data is normally distributed. So in the result, because p-value is not less than 0 0.05, so we do not reject or say we conclude that the data is not significantly different from normal distribution. Thanks for watching.